Hey guys, this is not our normal type of video, but I think it's a video that needs to be done. First off, I want to apologize for not responding to comments for such a long time. Um, and I want to explain a little bit of why I have not done so. I have been in a major depression for a long time now. That's why there's less and less of me in the videos. And there's less and less of me communicating with you guys in the comments. For those of you who don't know, I am bipolar. I am I have panic attacks, I have anxiety, I'm OCD, um, I'm manic depressed, and I've just been recently diagnosed with PTSD. And that was from my father dying, the PTSD. I held my father's hand as my father was dying. And I also held my sister's hand when my sister died. It's a very hard thing to do. It's hard watching someone die, let alone just being the one holding their hands as they take their last breath. My father died in June, and it was just his birthday this month. And I go into these major depressions, and I don't realize how long it's been. And I completely shut myself off from the world. People ask, how come I'm sick so often? And people who are depressed are sick a lot. It's a cycle. You get depressed, you get sick, you get sick, you get depressed, and so on and so forth. There's a lot of things going on in our lives that you all know about with, you know, Kevin losing his job us having financial difficulties with the house and so on and so forth. And it's all taken its toll. On top of my father passing. And I'm having a real hard time pulling out of this depression. Yes, I am on medication. Yes, I see a doctor. But I'm still having a very hard time. No, I am not suicidal. No, I don't want to hurt myself. No, I don't want to hurt others. But I put myself in a box and I shut myself off from the world. So basically what I'm trying to do is ask you guys to just please be patient with me. I will be able to pull myself out of this. I have done it before. This time it seems to be taking me longer than normal. Stick with us. The dogs want you to stick with us. <laughs> Okay, so we got interrupted, so we're back, and um, I forget exactly where we left off. Um, there are times of happiness. Kevin can pull me out of my depression, and I am so grateful to have Kevin, because if I didn't have Kevin, I would be depressed 24-7, 365 days a year. 
So I am so grateful to have Kevin. He is the happiness in my life. And he can get me out of this depression most of the time. For this particular time, I'm having a real hard time. But what this video is mainly about is me asking you guys to please not give up on us. We love doing YouTube and we want to continue to do YouTube. But we want to leave it up to you guys. Our videos have become extremely boring and we know that. We're not going anywhere. We're not doing anything. We sit here and one of our videos were the ortho neighbors. <laughs> because we just sit here and, and videotape Kevin painting or me coloring or us just talking and our videos have become very short and very boring and I'm not responding to comments. And we're not doing uh, shout outs anymore. I think we've lost a lot of people because of that. We will be getting back to all of that stuff. We will. So we want to leave it up to you guys. Do you want the neighbors to continue? Will you be patient with us and continue to follow along? Or should we just end our channel? And start back again maybe when I'm better or just end it all together. I don't know what to do. We don't know what to do. We enjoy so much bringing you happiness and making you guys laugh. And right now it's hard for us to do that considering our situation. But anyway, I feel this was a video that needed to be made to explain my situation to you guys a little bit more in detail and to let you know exactly what I'm going through, what we're going through. And hopefully you guys will understand. I love you all. I cherish every single one of you and I love all your comments. <laughs> 